basically everything I've ever done, I, I was so clueless and naive and I never knew like the real way it was supposed to be done, but maybe there isn't a real way and maybe that's the moral of the story, like there is no right way. I'm Cynthia Rowley and I am a proud alumni of the Art Institute of Chicago. When I was there, I remember they would always say, just do what you want, anything goes, like be as creative as possible. And I was making like crazy stuff. I mean like really crazy stuff that, you know, the idea was do it now because you, you won't get to do it later. So the experience of the school was, has made me, I think, think about fashion in the most creative way. So I moved to New York at a U-Haul filled with sewing machines, fabric, and no employees. I rented this uh, loft space and I started sewing and I made 30 looks and I printed invitations. I went around handing them out. I saw Andy Warhol in a cafe, saw him and I said, hi, I just wanted to invite you to my fashion show. And I went to hand him the invitation and he just looked up and said, thanks. And didn't, re you know, move his hand. So then I was like, and I just set it on the table. But then I told everyone, Andy Warhol's definitely coming. He thanked me for inviting him and, so then people, you know, that then started talking and then people started showing up. So a lot of people showed up at my um, first show. I mean, I think right now is the most exciting time for anyone who has a good idea. It's just like so easy to make something, put it out there, talk about it, tell your story. That's what it's all about, you know, in any kind of artistic, creative endeavor. It's like, you know, at the Art Institute, I really learned that, you know, there could be this community and a conversation about whatever work you were making and, you know, went in thinking one thing and then learned a more expansive, creative way to think about everything.